Popular successful international business mogul and son of Mosoga Kingdom in Ethiopia's local government area of Delta State, Comrade Godi Eferego Matthew has officially entered the race in the 2023 elections for member representing Ethiopia's constituency at the Delta State House of Assembly. Mosoga Town was set alight as a crowd of followers consisting of chiefs, elders, and youths from Ogara and Ijere Kingdom, all of which make up Ethiopia's local government, joined Mosoga natives as they stormed the home of Comrade Eferego in solidarity of his mandate. Comrade Godi Eferego, a philanthropist and helper of hundreds in Ethiopia West, having obtained success outside politics through business, spoke to the crowd and officially announced the flag of his political group, the Godi Eferego Political Forum. He said the group is yet towards working with all leaders in Ethiopia West and went on to announce his ambition to run for Delta State House of Assembly, Ethiopia West constituency in 2023. <laughs> which is forum PDP. still going to announce to you that me, God is I'm coming out for data state. Uh, House of Assembly, Ethiopia West constituency. Overwhelmed by the all encompassing speech of Comrade Eferego, a host of dignitaries and youths present expressed delight at the rich antecedents of Comrade Eferego and pledged their support to his cause. My name is Anthony Efemini. As far as I'm concerned, my God, Eferego Omene, has been my shadow friend. I say, I'm giving you my support 100%. 100 over 100. It should go further. It should test what is called politics and the, uh, the power in there. Not to destroy, but to help the masses. I, I welcome him. You know, God bless you. My name is Freeborn Atenica from JC, popularly known as Honga Gone. God is a very gentle guy, fresh guy, correct guy. I never say I say you got problem with one person. Me the mula go go vote ah. Olo lo ko si eh. O petition o ko. But say you come out for us of assembly. Listen, listen, of the truth. I'm very happy. And I know say you go win. You go win. My name is uh, Engineer Rufus Oibo. I'm, I'm from JC. The politics of Kerala would need the youth to come out. We must set our way to you to that. You know, uh, if Makoda go back and if Makoda come back and lie, he said that uh, the politics is that. I want to reform for four months, but it's thirty years. Come back for the time. I want to do that. So, we must be for that. Every two years, we need to be come together. I want, I want to go for that. <laughs> My name is Blessing of God. Our generation, we don't know. And we cannot die again because of lack of knowledge. We don't get knowledge. I didn't know that. I have been a rabbi. 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 <laughs> and there, can I say, you No, 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 I'm here to support my brother. I'm here to support my 
Thank you, ladies. We are here to support him. We are very happy to see a young, vibrant personnel like him coming out for the position of House of Assembly member. Yeah. We don't welcome God for that listen appointment. We are tired of Ogasi, Ogasi, Ogasi. We want to hear from the Ogasi direct. If we all unite together to stand by him, we we'll definitely get to where we are going to. The God, my mama. Are you? 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 Are in this 2023 election, there must be shaving. How can somebody, just one person, holding a position up to seven from 1997 to date? It's not done. What do you mean? We'll be there in our next register. I want everybody to mobilize for God if you go. Go home. If you are a man, talk to your wife. If you have a grown-up children, talk to your children. Yeah, there is a man who will wipe away the tears from our eyes. And right now, tell them to support Comrade God if you are a If you are a woman, go to your husband. Talk to your husband. That this is the somebody. My name is Cynthia Kakada. I'm here because of Ogidi. He's coming out for us of assembly. Ogidi is a very quiet man and he shares love. He don't, he don't normally do discrimination. He helps the widow, he helps the poor. Allah, let us allow Ogidi to be our He's the right man, the people's choice. Man that has been that has been representing his people outside the country where I met him. Talk less to talk about in his place. So he's just the people's choice. This is the man we need. This is the man we need. His declaration to go for the House of Assembly come 2023 for a two West constituency. It's not only his will, but it is a general call by the constituency by the youth, by the women, by the men, and by the general public here in the West. We are calling on him to come and represent us for credibility, for capability, and for prudency. Finally, the aspirant told Rero TV in an interview that he is so elated at the vast acceptance of his ambition by his people and hinted that his administration will cater for youths and women across Ethiopia West. I'm very, very happy today to see this huge mama crowd coming out for me, to stand for me, to go for Delta State House of Assembly, Ethiopia West constituencies. They, they, they so much believe on me. They know what I'm capable of doing. They know what I can do. They know I will represent them fully well. That is why you can see they all come in number to support me. During the course of your speech, uh, you laid so much emphasis on youth development in uh, Ethiopia. West. Uh, can you tell us more on this? Uh, I always emphasize on the youth in all my speech. Because it is even the pain of the youth that made me to come out to say, let me put my flag up to go for this House of Assembly political road so that I can re represent them very well because I can see that they are not being represented very well. Because me, myself, I'm, I'm still a youth, but I can see they have not been represented very well. How can you say, like in Mosoga now, the youth in Mosoga, 98% of the youth of in Mosoga, they are jobless. They are jobless and nobody cares about them to empower them or to think of skill acquisition program or scholarship or whatsoever. So when I come to Mosoga, all the youths, you see a, so a youth of 35 years, 40 years, 32 years, they will be running down to me. I don't have money to feed my wife. I don't have money to send my child to school. I don't have money to pay me to, to do this. I don't have, my wife just gave birth. I don't have money to declare. I will be giving them money, giving them money, giving them. So long will I continue to be giving them fish? It's better you teach these people how to fish.
So that is why I now some more courage. Let me go and represent these people so that I can help them and create better future for them. So I can live a better life, not this suffering life I'm seeing. That is why you see me so much emphasizing on the youth. Because the youth, the guests, the ladies, the boys, they are suffering. They are suffering and nobody is thinking about how they are well being. No, so I'm coming out to make sure that, in short, when I'm, when I'm appointed, the first thing that I will be thinking of is how to eradicate poverty from the youths of Ethiopia and the ladies of Ethiopia. And I will make sure women fully participate in politics. We have the first, I believe to me, that we have the first woman counselor from this my Mosoga kingdom. In Mosoga, my name is Akbarero Henry Akbos, and this is Railroad TV. Thank you for watching.